Hello and good evening. Yesterday we showed you leaked body cam video anonymously sent to Fox 4 News showing a Balch Springs police supervisor tasing a man in handcuffs. We reported how it was other Balch Springs officers who brought the April 2016 incident to the attention of the police chief. Both his department and outside investigators reviewed the incident and the chief punished the sergeant who used the taser. First on Fox 4 News 6, James Rose talked to the man who was tased. James. Guys, Marco Stevenson acknowledges he has a reputation with law enforcement. He says when he found out about a report, he wanted to tell his side of the story, but he did not want to see the video. He totally did me wrong, but I'm a Christian, so I don't, I'm not revengeful. I took it, and I just kept on going. Marco Stevenson is the man in this Box Springs police body cam video being tased while in handcuffs. In April of last year, Box Springs officers responded to a 911 call about a man waving around a pistol in a neighborhood. As the officer with the body cam arrives, you can see Stevenson is on his knees with his hands on his head and appears to be complying. Officers approach with guns drawn. A gun is kicked away, later determined to be a BB gun. But watch it, Marco. I spit a toothpick in the crash. Moments later, after Stevenson was handcuffed, police say he spit toward one of the officers and was tased. Don't pull away. You understand? You understand? Don't pull away. You understand? Don't pull away. Don't pull away. Don't pull away. You get it? Do you get it? Yes, sir. Spit a toothpick out over my over his shoulder. He's cocky and arrogant, and he. Well, you spit it young. over his shoulder. Over his shoulder, yes, sir. Well, it's it was not on him. Space. We asked him why he's never viewed the police video, even after we showed it in our story Tuesday evening. I've lived through it myself, so I, I didn't want to look at it because I don't want to traumatize myself and think about how the injustice in Box Springs is going, so I told myself not to look at it. Stevenson is well known to police, being booked into jail 36 times for charges ranging from criminal trespass to drug possession. He even pleaded guilty to aggravated assault on a Balk Springs officer. He never filed a complaint against the officer who tased him, despite other Balk Springs officers urging him to report it. I had two officers come to me and say I need to report it, but I said it's like a hornet's nest. If I hit the hornet's nest, some going to come after me, some going to go the other way. Balk Springs Police Chief Jonathan Haber says the sergeant's own officers ended up reporting the incident to him, and the video was reviewed by the Texas Rangers and the Dallas County DA's Public Integrity Unit. Neither agency found evidence of criminal wrongdoing, but the chief reprimanded his sergeant and put him on no contact with the public until he completed a series of training courses. Do you feel somewhat relieved knowing that other cops said this is not okay and they went to the chief? Yes, sir, because that lets me know there are some cops that are righteous, that are doing the right thing. Now, Stevenson says it was two white officers that urged him to report the incident, and it wasn't until we spoke this morning, he says, that he realized it was those Balk Springs officers who reported their own sergeant. He says he did not know the sergeant was punished, but now says he believes that punishment should have been more severe. We asked the police department for a response today, but we were told there would be no further comment. Stephen Heather. All right, James Rose, thank you.